This is always probably my least favorite day of the year. It takes two days when I have to make some decisions on who's marching and who isn't. There'll be some of you who won't be marching. There'll be some of you who might be marching the first game, may not march the second game, may not march the rest of the season. That's the process. You're going to have to earn your spot. You have to earn your spot. And there will be people who will be disappointed. But if, that, if you're disappointed, do something about it. Yarr! Do something about it. I think the people around will tell you there's plenty of opportunity for you to take us the next step. There's plenty of opportunity to get in the group, to get in a regular spot. But if you don't keep up the intensity, you'll lose that spot. That's the process, and it works. And I think it works really well for what we're doing. Uh, I know you. I know I haven't been around a lot recently, and uh, I just want to take a minute to explain a little bit. Um, a few weeks ago, I, I found out I had a uh, a problem with the medicine medicine I'd been taking, and it caused a bad reaction. And the doctors told me I I shouldn't. Uh, do anything for a couple of days. First thing I did was try to find new doctors. <laughs> but uh, uh, basically, they, they told me to take it easy and to not do anything for a while. So that's the reason I've been I've not been here. Uh, it was hard. It was hard. Uh, but the thing that I would say is I am so delighted with what Darren did, filling in. And uh, I was worried, <laughs> not because of him, but because uh, I, I thought you. I thought you might say this is an opportunity for us to back off. You didn't. You didn't. That's what. That's what we're about. That's what we're about. When it comes time to do the job, you do the job. Um, Been, uh, been a difficult, uh, it's been a difficult time in my history recently, and I don't want to recount a lot of it. Uh, most of you know about it. I think the most difficult thing was uh, uh, a year ago. when I lost the love of my life. And for, uh, we've been together married for 62 years. And uh, we started going together when we were in the seventh grade. <laughs> uh, can you imagine anybody putting up with me that long? <laughs> uh, I wish and I said this to you before, I wish to each of you, you have that kind of uh, relationship in your life. I hope that you do. It's been very important to me. The thing I wanted you to, to hear me say is uh, last May, I made a decision. This is going to be my last year. Um, I had hoped my last year would be one where I could say, uh, I went out thinking I shouldn't have, I, I still had a few years left in me. That train may have left the station a long time ago. Um, but nonetheless, um, No one knows about this decision now except a few people within the university hierarchy. Uh, there will be some kind of a press release today, later today, tomorrow. Uh, but you're the first ones to know. And I insisted to the university that you be the first ones to know. That was my, my, if you 
you can make a demand <laughs> at the university. I, that's what I did. Uh, I wanted you to be the first ones because you're special. And you're special, I don't care whether it's because you're in the band for the first time or never been in the band until you walked on this field last week, but it's special. This band is special. And there will be a there will be a search committee. There will be a search and they'll go through all the things at the university regulations make you have make us have to do uh, I won't be a part of it but uh, it, what I hope to hear from you is this band won't change it might change in the way you do little things because when I came here 50 years ago you should have heard the uproar when I and I said well we're going to do this and they say we're going to do what <laughs> and uh, you change you must maintain, you must maintain the tradition, the intensity, the intensity, the desire, and everything that everybody for the last 50 years has brought to this group. And, and I would be sorely disappointed if I see that doesn't happen. It's in your hands to do that. I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful we could have business as usual, but I know that's not going to happen. You can't have business as usual when you know something so momentous is going to happen in terms of your intensity. But keep the fun in it. It's supposed to be fun. <laughs> it's supposed to be fun. And if you don't, but you can't have fun without excellence. I, I learned that a long time ago. You can't have fun without excellence. You can say you're having fun, but if you don't have that sense of excellence in what you do, it's not fun. It's just going through the motions. We can't ever go through the motions. We can't ever. There's so much more I want to say to you, but I... I'll probably be saying it in the subsequent weeks. And you probably won't like a lot of them. Because <laughs> I'm going to try not, I'm not going to try to change anything. I want the intensity. When we start on Monday, I want the intensity. And, and if you see I'm dragging, let me know. Because <laughs> you do anyhow. I talk an awful lot. moments of happiness. You've all heard me talk about it. Moments of happiness are there in all your lives. You all have moments of happiness. You don't have complete happiness. Nobody does. Nobody does. You can't have that. It's not life. Remember what John Lennon said. Life is what happens while you're making other plans. <laughs> and uh, I've had, you've provided me with so many moments of happiness. I can't even begin to say this, but I will tell you, those moments of happiness are what have gotten me through any difficult time. I hope it, it can do it for you too. Live on those moments, because they're going to be there. They may be here on the field next Friday night, who knows? They may be here in November, when we're freezing our asses. <laughs> live for those moments of happiness and remember them. And uh, I'm sure we'll have a couple more conversations before the year's over. Um, 
again, no one know. You're the only ones who know this up to this point, and uh, you're special. You're very special. This is out of the norm. We don't usually do this <laughs> at this particular rehearsal. The CJ, I'd really like it if we do varsity. Yar. 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 Yar.